everyone and welcome to Kate Times 2 Reborn Nursery. I am KJ and I have here a little rattle because yes, I still am the premier Rebornless Reborn channel. But today I wanted to come on because I have a special haul to share with you today. As you know, if you've been following the channel for a bit, I like to share and find new boutiques and whenever I do find them, I like to share them with the community. That way, if you see something that you like, that you could support um, this new company as well. So today I'm featuring a company. Um, I won't say that it's a new company, but it's new to me. But the name of the company is Ebony Seeds Boutique. Um, this is the package. The items came very, very fast. I just happened to see the company via Instagram and I saw that they had a sale. So I said, well, let me just see what the company's about. So I ordered some items and they came within days. The turnaround time was really, really quick. So this is the package um, that the items came in. I have pre-opened them because I did not want to do the rattling on camera. Um, but it is packaged very nice. You receive this nice card that just says, hey love, uh, thanks for shopping with us. Can't wait to see your little seedling in your pieces. Love Ebony Seeds Co. Um, Want to get social. They are actually on Instagram and Facebook. So if you see fit, check them out. But let's get right into this haul so that we don't make the video longer than it has to be. But I'll place everything here. I'm going to be using my bloom chair today uh, to showcase what I have. So the first item that I purchased was a pair of velvet uh, bow socks. Um, these socks were actually on clearance. It's a taupe color and the velvet bow is sort of a creamish color, I guess. Not cream, but it's more of a, uh, I guess the color bone would be probably the best way to describe the color. But as you see, the velvet bow, very big bow. I thought the socks were really cute. Um, so that's one of the items that I have. Then was this nice uh, gingham dress. This is the top. And this actually is, I believe, six to eight. I mean, six to, uh, six to 12 months, yes. Six to 12 month size. It is a very roomy top, as you see. Um, you have the little gathered uh, portion there. It has like the little ruffle detailing. It has a linen-like feel. These are the bloomers. And again, that's six to 12 months. It seems to be really big. So once I do have a baby to show, we'll see how it fits. Um, second item is this beautiful um, cocoa colored sleeper. It's a ruffled sleeper. It has a very uh, quality wise. Let me tell you everything that I've looked at so far is very nice material. Um, a very nice cotton uh, ribbed material. Um, and it does have little footies. It does have the footies. Um, it is zippered and you do have the zipper covering. And again, I believe this will be a six to 12 month size. Yes, it is. And everything has the tags. Um, I don't see a tag in here, but I do believe everything I got was six to 12 months. I also purchased this nice uh, ripped uh, rib stripe one. <laughs> it's ribbed and it's also striped. It's more of a, I'm pretty sure it's not showing the colors correctly. This is a nine to 12 months. It comes with a matching sash that you can use as a headband. Um, but it is more like a rose and I would say maybe a, not quite burgundy, but a mauve maybe color. Mauve and like a, uh, let's see, a deep rose. I don't know what I want to say this color is, but hopefully you can see here. But this one um, is not the footed one, but I thought it was really cute. Um, like I said, again, this is a 9 to 12 months. I think that would be very nice. And then we have this nice onesie. Um, this is a size, this is a medium. So I'm thinking it's more of a 6 to 12 again month size. It has on it, um, my black is beautiful, written all over it. I thought that was really, really nice. It's in the brown uh, earth tone colors. I thought that was super cute. And the feel of it, of course, you can't tell the feel, but it's a very, very soft, very, very soft cotton uh, type feel. And then the final thing that I got was this, uh, this is a six to nine months. This is a ruffled uh, little onesie. 
nine to 12 months again, like I said, um, you have a little ruffle bottom there. You have some ruffle detailing in the front. This color is more, it's different than the uh, first item that I had. Um, that was more of a cocoa. This more, this is more of a pumpkin like color. Um, it is all in the brown family, but I love the color offerings that the company had. Like I said, I'm very, very, very satisfied and pleased with the material. Um, super um, pleased with the time, the shipping time. Everything came in really nice. It was wrapped um, in this tissue paper with the logo again. Um, each item was individually wrapped, um, covered, indiv individually colored covered i'm gonna get it right it was individually covered so it was uh shipped and prepared properly i'm very very pleased i certainly will be buying again and again if you are interested in that company the name is ebony seeds company ebony seeds baby boutique let me say it right or you can find them under ebony seeds co and you can find them on facebook and instagram they definitely get the K times two seal of approval. I can't wait to get a baby to actually show how it looks. You guys probably, if you purchase, will be able to put your babies in it before I will. But if you do, um, take some pictures and give the company a shout out. I, I'm very pleased with the items. And if you like lay it items for your babies, neutral colors, earth tone colors, this is going to be your place. And price range is awesome. So check them out. Check them out. I am not a paid paid sponsor. I'm just a customer who wants to share boutique. But as you know, my shopping never stops there. So I, I actually um, was minding my business and one of my Dolly sisters um, let me know that Janie and Jack had a clearance sale. And I was getting the emails, but I didn't look because I was not in the market to buy the clothing, being that, clothing rather, being that I didn't have a baby. But as you know, Janie and Jack is one of my favorite stores and I only shop them typically when there's a sale. And this one was one that I could not pass up. So let's start with item number one. We have this two piece set. It's like plaid pants. I love Janie and Jack's detailing and quality. It's second to none. Like I said, they can be typically pricey and for a doll, I don't like spending a lot more, but if I had, um, grandchildren naturally my children are too old now but if i had grandchildren i definitely would be buying Janie and jack for them so that's outfit number one this is outfit number two which was a very nice clearance price i couldn't pass it up um it's not one of my favorite prints but hey when you get something that's really really um affordable you can't help but get it so that's going to be a nice little bubble rumper for her with a little nice uh collar um this is absolutely one of my favorites it's not quite uh, the size of the dolls that I typically get. This will be more for like uh, a larger doll. This is an 18 to 24 months, but it was like the only one in the size. Um, it's a gold jumper. Check it out. A gold metallic like jumper. Look at the back. Like I said, Janie and Jack's quality. You just can't beat it. So um, this may be a little larger, but we'll see. We'll see how that works. We'll see how that works. Um, this is a sweater dress. This is a 6 to 12 months. I just like the pastel rainbow theme. I think for a princess unicorn uh, theme baby, that's like the perfect color scheme. Perfect dress. It's nice. Um, like I said, this definitely will be worn in the winter, even though it has spring vibes to it as well. So it could be worn in the spring. I definitely would not recommend summer because it will be hot. It's a very, very thick type uh, sweater material, but nonetheless, very cute. Now, as you know, I don't put dark colors on my babies very often, but this dress to me just screams breakfast at Tiffany's, elegance, fancy. I couldn't pass it up. It's like a pleated dress. And <laughs> look at those sleeves. Look at the sleeves. So I think when I want to do like a nice pearls with like baby dress, don't care kind of, uh, you know, outfit, this is definitely it. Just really dressy and classy. And here is another jumpsuit. Um, this one has the short sleeves. It has the nice ruffles. Again, this is a nice material. It has like a confetti type color scheme to it, but it is mainly like a um, off-white color. But you see those uh, confetti, deck, uh, the confetti like, uh, I don't even want to say print, but you see what I'm talking about. <laughs> you get what I'm saying. So um, you have that one. Um, this is one of my favorite ones. I just love the vibrance of this color. The style is similar to the rainbow pastel dress, 
but this color is just like boom bold it just look how it comes up and like i said i don't have the best lighting in here i'm using artificial lighting i like natural lighting better um but it's very late at night so i have no natural light out right now but um love the color of this dress and of course you got to have a little leopard print in your closet <laughs> um again this is a print i don't typically put on dolls um or small i wouldn't put on a little girl too much or a doll but um it was a six to twelve month i think there are a lot of things you can do with it you can add a denim jacket to it to kind of make it casual with some chucks you can also dress it up with some black lace like stockings a nice little pair of uh, black patent leather shoes make it really cute add a little black little purse and make her look like a little lady just so many things you could do with it and then the final thing that i purchased which is absolutely one of my favorites is going to be this ballerina sweatshirt and this is actually what made me go to the sale um because my dolly sister miss lg <laughs> was looking at this so this is what it looks like um in person i think it's very cute i like that mosaic face that they have on there with the different um earth tones which kind of reminds me of the color scheme for um ebony seeds co they kind of have that same brown palette uh there but i also have this tutu um pink skirt that will go with it when I want to have that nice little ballerina feel. This just reminds me so much of going to see Dance Theater of Harlem. Like I said, if I was taking my daughter or my granddaughter whenever I have them um, to see Dance Theater of Harlem or the Alvinelli Dance Company, I probably would get her dressed up in something like this and um, put her on like some really, really cute shoes. And this will be her little outfit. I just think it's really girly, really frilly, really um, just cute. It's cute. So I, I just had to have it and I think it just pairs really well with the uh, with the skirt. And this is something too, you can kind of casual it and put some chucks with it or you can um, even put the white walker shoes with it or you can dress it up with even some gold uh, ballerina slippers. So it's just a lot of things or black, either one. You can do a lot with that. So that's it. That is uh, all the hauls that I have. That's like 12 minutes in. So I hope you enjoyed the haul. Um, hopefully I'll have some baby news coming soon. I have no idea when, so <laughs> just stay tuned. I haven't gone anywhere. It's, if I come up with some nice haul items or something of that degree, I definitely will come back and share it with you all. But I did want to share, um, Ebony, um, Seeds Co. with you. If I have, like I said, any more, um, new boutiques or new nursery news, I definitely will share that with you. So, don't unsubscribe stay subscribed because i definitely will be back in full swing um pretty soon that's the goal so again i will leave this information um i'll also show it at the end of the video so i hope you enjoyed the haul if you did just give the video a thumbs up also if you're new to the channel um stick with us because like i said i do have hauls often i think i said i wanted to do more outings this year but we'll kind of see how this whole uh, uh this whole thing is going like i said we have a doll show now that's canceled it's just a lot of things i don't know when i'll be able to get back into uh dolly life but anyway um outings rather dolly outings but we'll see but thank you for tuning in don't forget to hit the like button make sure you share this with someone if you saw some items that you think someone would be interested in um and stay tuned for more videos to come so until the next one take care and i will see you later goodbye mm -hmm.